This tip demonstrates a feature of the Mac OS X Finder called Quick Look. Quick Look debuted in System 10.5, Leopard, and is one of the quickest and handiest tools available for sampling and locating files on your Mac. Let's take a look at what it can do. Take a look at the JPEGs folder on the right. Let's open it up. Inside there are three files. Now suppose I wanted to locate a file that I wanted to use in a project. Ordinarily, I just need to double click on the file and open it, but there's a faster way now. Select the file and hit spacebar. And Quick Look will look inside the file and show it to me on the screen in a small window. Right in the finder. I can navigate the list by hitting the down arrow. Take a look at the second one, the third one. And when I'm done, I can close the little window and I can move on to some other files. Take a look at those. So let's see what else it can work with. Let's open up the text folder, for instance. Here's an RTF or a rich text document. If I hit spacebar again, I can look inside it and I can read the contents of it. I can go down the list and sample a Word document and look inside another text document to see what's in there. I might want to collect those and use those for something that I want to email a friend or use in a project. What else can Quick Look do? Well, Quick Look can look inside and sample almost every common image file. Here are some TIFFs, for instance. And PDF files as well. Oh, what's that? Well, if I do a quick look on the folder itself, quick look can't look inside a folder all by itself and see the content, so it gives me a generic icon. Quick look works with most common file types, but not everything. And when it can't see the contents of a file, it just gives you the standard finder icon. And you can move on from there. No harm done. So let's open the PDF folder now. Select it. Spacebar. And now I'm looking inside a PDF document. And I can single page through the document and locate a passage of text or a graphic that I might be interested in. Just the same as if I opened it up with a PDF viewer. Looking at another document, you see the same is true. I can single step through the document. Here's a full page document. I might need to expand that so I can use the resize tab in the lower right corner to get a bigger view of it. Even to the point of looking at a full page booklet. Now if I hit command minus, I zoom out of the quick look. If I hit command plus, I can zoom in. Wow. Quick Look has a lot of handy features. Now let's take a look at some of the other files it works on. MP3 files. Select an MP3 off your desktop, hit spacebar, and Quick Look plays MP3 files. How about movie files now? Open the movie folder. Select a movie file. Hit spacebar. Yep, movie file is playing. And I have control over it. I can hit the pause button. I can resume play. Once again, using the up arrow key in this case, I'm going to play the second movie in the list. Let's go up and sample the next one. Quick Look plays movies. So we've tried JPEG files, TIFF files, text files, PDF files, MP3 files, and movie files. 
It'll also open other word processing, spreadsheet, presentation documents like PowerPoint, and even open text documents from OpenOffice and NeoOffice. So give it a try. I think it's going to be one of your most popular features of the Mac OS X Finder.